Welcome back to Healing Oz. This is Brielle. And today, instead of doing a one card for the message from Spirit for Aquarius for September 22nd and the message from the Saint, we're going to just do a three card spread for Aquarius for the message. We're using the Tarot, the complete kit, and it's a little cute little mini deck. And we'll look for our message for Aquarius. And we're going to be taking three cards. And I will go ahead and cut the deck in three and use the three cards at the top for the message for Aquarius for September 22nd of 2020. What does Aquarius need to know? Spirit, what does Aquarius need to know for September 22nd of 2020? There's one card, gosh, judgment. I was going to cut the deck, but I guess it's best to take the cards that are given. So, because a lot of times I don't have cards jumping out, but this time I, I do. So we'll go with that. September the 22nd, 2020, Aquarius. What does Aquarius need to know? And this little deck is um, based on the Rider Waite classic deck instead of an Oracle deck. So today is a bit different, trying to, to do different things. Okay, card number two, we have the Six of Pentacles. And what does Aquarius need to know, Spirit? Oh, here we go, the lovers. So we're looking to see what Aquarius needs to know for September the 22nd. So here in the past, we can see a little butterfly and he is holding, he's holding on to the, uh, a key. This butterfly is holding on to a key. So judgment. I'm looking at this as he has the answer. Now he's gone through some change and he has the answer. So here there was change in the past and the answer is here. The key. What should have happened or needed to happen, happened. And understanding of it has taken place. Now, these might not be the traditional uh, interpretations or if you look in the book, but I, I'm going on what Spirit is telling me and giving me. I see here the Six of Pentacles. We can see that this is something that is a beginning. This is... Uh, about day to day this is about practical things this is about the fact that now there is a i would say a, a, a the basics the the basics are there the the rebuilding of the basics the starting of or not even the starting it's it's a solid loaf of bread and there is more coming from it it's surrounded it's pentacles are on it. It's surrounded by pentacles. We see the vine growing. So I can say that, yeah, there is definitely foundation there that is growing. So this, this realization and this transformation has begun to yield benefit, solid benefit, something that is, is, is practical, something that is useful, usable. And we can see in the future, it shows the lover's card. So that is the six in the major arcana, the lovers. And it shows what looks like two people frolicking. And they certainly have um, around them signs of fruitfulness, signs of joy, signs of beauty. So in the future will come some more enjoyment. So you've transformed, you have received some answers or the key, key information. Right now is a time to settle down and focus on the practical things to begin to, to grow, to pay attention to things that are more practic practical and in the future, life will bring further enjoyment and maybe even a partner 
whether it's the same partner as before or a different partner I don't know but it looks like there is joy or enjoyment coming up in life again because right now you're focused on the things that are the practical things so let's see if I can figure out here about the the lovers the lovers spirit the lovers is this a lover from the past is this a reconciliation or reuniting or is this something new is this going to be a new situation the lovers card that shown that shows in the future or is it going to be something from the past is this something new or something from the past we'll look for one card just to clarify the lovers card that shows in the future is this something new or is it something from the past what is the message spirit as far as well the lovers can you identify oh lord help us too many cards there something new or something from the past i have to reshuffle because i cannot um something new something from the past what does the lover's card signify? <laughs> I remember earlier on this week I had a deck that was so big it was hard to shuffle. Now this deck is so little that it is also difficult to shuffle because it's, it's small. Maybe I just need some shuffling skills. How about that? Okay, let's see. One card for us. Okay, there's our card. The Queen of Wands. So the Queen of Wands looks to me like a wand. The light beside her in the candle. She's holding up the wand. She'll ho she's holding up the flower. So this is action. This is about movement and action, not about um, thought. But this looks like moving on. Because, gosh, she's covered with the beauty and the fruitfulness. And she's certainly in control because she's in control of both of them. She's holding them up. The light here signifies that she's also well aware. So, I say this is something new. This is being in control of a situation and moving on to something new. And then having the totality. Of, of of happiness here being in control not not just the, the um, enjoyment here but being in control and having everything including enlightenment that's what the candle shows me having it all including enlightenment the fruitfulness the happiness the enlightenment the joy we see here the companionship but that's what the future holds. One more card I ask, just to say clarification of the future. What can Aquarius expect in the future? What can Aquarius expect in the future? One card for what Aquarius can expect in the future. Just one more message, please. expect in the future <clears throat> well, then we can see the happiness here the partnership the being in control of the situation and being enlightened oh god very sorry we'll keep shuffling if not i will just go ahead and just cut the cards to find out because the cards are quite slippery. What can Aquarius affect? What can Aquarius expect in the future? 
regarding this message. What else? What else? What else to clarify? Okay, we do have a king of pentacles. So queen of one, a king of pentacles. <clears throat> so the king of pentacles, security. <laughs> so you not only have the joy, the enlightenment, the um, abundance, but also a king of pentacles. He's very sure, he's very secure, very steady, and very loyal, and very loyal. So a solid, loyal relationship is what I'm seeing here. So that's all good news. A change and transformation, finding out something that's key, very or very important. Focus currently on the basics, the key main day-to-day -day items. The future will bring joy, love, security, and a good partner. That's the message for today, the 22nd of September for Aquarius. Thank you for coming to visit. Please visit, uh, visit on Instagram at healing underscore oaths. Like, subscribe, visit our store in the link down below in the, uh, below the video. And Wish you health, love, happiness, peace, and prosperity. Thank you.